Ugh. I'm trying to sit down and talk at the same time and I can't. Ugh. Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today we are graduating. I just really wanted to record this because not only am I sharing, you know, a good old video with you guys, but it also is something that I can look back on. And I'm so excited. This is the first time I'm walking in any college graduation. I did not walk in my undergrad because there was COVID and I graduated in December. But this time, I'm graduating, it's spring, I'm able to walk in the actual ceremony, and I'm so excited. Winnie the Pooh's character is very significant in my life, and I wanted to bring Pooh along with me on graduation. So let me show you guys my cap. Wait, the S fell off! This is gonna be really tough because this is my cap. I'm gonna show you guys like this. It's a quote that Christopher Robin said to Pooh, I'm pretty sure. It has a little studious looking Winnie the Pooh. I got like the border, a little glitter, and then up close it's actually flowers and bees. If anyone is ever thinking of doing like a cap or just anything like this, go to Hobby Lobby. I've never been to Hobby Lobby before. It's just really convenient. They have everything you can look for. All these little flowers and like, I was gonna use these but I didn't end up using them. These are like gold lettering and this is white lettering but this, was, this all came in handy. I ended up using these baby little bees right here. I was gonna put a bow on it, but that didn't work out. I also did not want to use a hot glue gun at all, so I got these little, uh, these are like double-sided sticker pads, I wanna say, but those worked really nicely because everything just glued right to it. You can see it's on the hat, and it gives it a little bit more dimension because it sticks out. So I showered and my hair, I have to wear my cap. So, I wanna straighten the top parts of my hair and then curl from here going down so that it has a little bit more shape, but I don't want the tops of my hair to be curled because it's gonna stick out of my cap like crazy. If anybody has curly hair, you know the struggle. So you see how this part's straight and it's nice and then down here still has the frizz, which we can easily control. So I figured that the only way I can successfully do my hair and know how it's gonna look in my cap is by doing my hair in my cap. Ooh. All right, let's see. If I do these elongated, maybe they'll just look loose. I hate tight curls. Sorry, I just hate them. Okay, so like, top part is straight, but then it goes into a nice little curl. Okay, I think I like that. I got such a bad burn last time from this curling wand. It gets so hot, it touches your skin. You're done. You're done though. I think I got it, because now the hair is like curled, but oh, I just hate the way this hat looks. This is like the worst. Who created this? Looks way better without the hat on, but the hair is curled now. We're gonna move on to makeup. That's gonna be a whole separate video. So you guys can go click on the card somewhere on the top and you can watch me do the makeup. Okay, this is it. The last thing that I have to submit ever. <sighs> Where is it? Yes. Wait, let me just make sure it's correct. Submit it successfully! I did it! There's no point. It's only for the name. I read my wife said she's gonna take a picture of you with her camera, so look at